Hello everyone. Welcome to Traveling Bits. In this video, we are going to talk about the lockdown in the state of Tamil Nadu. The lockdown will be in force from 4 a.m. of 10th May to 4 a.m. of 24th May. The decision has been announced by the new Chief Minister, M.K. Stalin, keeping in mind the huge surge in the state for COVID-19 cases in Tamil Nadu. E-registration is mandatory for travelers entering Tamil Nadu from other states and countries by flights, trains, or roads. We will now see during the lockdown what is allowed and what is not allowed. So first, let's go ahead and see what is allowed. Vaccination centers will continue to operate in the lockdown period. Hotels and restaurants can function from 6 a.m. to 10 a.m., 12 p.m. to 3 p.m., 6 p.m. to 9 p.m. For takeaways only, tea shops with takeaway service only can operate till noon. Food delivery aggregators like Swiggy, Zomatos will be allowed to operate during the above hours. E-commerce companies are allowed to provide food, groceries, meat, provision services. Amma canteens will be open. Flower and fruit pedestrian shops can operate till noon. Ration shops will operate from 8 a.m. till noon. Hotel or lodges will be open only for customers who are to stay for financial or medical related works. A maximum of 50 people are allowed to participate in marriages and 20 members in funerals. Banks and other related services will operate with 50% workforce. Apart from necessary state departments like Secretariat, Health, Revenue and Disaster Management, Police, Fire, Prison, Forest, Local Municipal Administration, Women and Social Welfare, others own function. Hospitals, labs, pharmacies, medical related shops, ambulance and here's services will operate. Courier services will function. Lorries, tankers carrying fuel, oxygen, raw materials will be allowed to ply. Ongoing construction work will be allowed to carry on. Continuous processing industries and industrial manufacturing essential commodities will continue to function. Petrol and diesel stations will operate as usual. All standalone groceries, fish and meat stalls will be allowed to operate till noon with 50% customers. Let's now see what is not allowed. Private and public bus transport, taxis, cabs, autos will not ply. People will be allowed to travel for marriages, funerals and other emergency services without proper records. Restriction on international flight service will continue to be in force. State-run liquor store, TASMAC, will not operate in the lockdown period. Cultural, political, sports, entertainment, education and other religious events are banned in both indoor and outdoor spaces. Ban on big format shops with a size of more than 3000 square feet shopping complex and mall will continue. Beauty parlor, haircutting saloons, spas are not allowed to function. Other places like recreation clubs, all bars, entertainment and amusement parks, which can draw a large number of crowds are not allowed to operate. Theaters and multiplexes will remain shut. Retail shops in Coimbedu market will remain closed. Private companies, including IT, ITES, will remain closed. Staffs are encouraged to work from home. All places of worship will remain closed for the public. Tourist places like Nilgiris, Kodai Canal, Yarkar will not open for the public. Schools, colleges, universities, and private training institutes are not allowed to conduct summer camp. Let me again uh, inform you that any people coming from other states to Tamil Nadu or from foreign countries will have to do a registration online. And the website is eregister.tneg.org. I will provide you the complete 
registration URL and all these details in the description section of this video. Please follow them. Please keep yourself safe. These are the essential guidelines which has been framed for the lockdown in Tamil Nadu. Please follow them for your own safety and other people's safety. Please be safe. Have a good day. Please subscribe to our channel Traveling Bits and click on the bell icon for future updates. Thank you.